Good morning to you. It is Sunday, January the 14th. I'm in Oklahoma City, standing up in my truck. Here it is, Oklahoma City Pilot Truck Stop or something. It has a McDonald's. I got some biscuits. I got a lot to hear. I think I'm ready to roll. I don't know. I think that's all it takes is some some breakfast food and some coffee. And I think a man can roll with that, in my humble opinion. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to try to get to, well, I am going to get to Memphis tonight. I got, you know, 470 maybe miles. I don't know, probably about an eight hour drive is probably what it's going to be. Um, and that's going to be a cross dock. And I'm really, I'm hoping, oh, I'm hoping so much that they're going to be able to do, to take a load off of me today. I called the warehouse manager and he didn't pick up, so I might have to do that again, 483 miles. Maybe I might even go all the way through without stopping. Ooh, if I don't get too hungry, or if I don't have to go to the restroom. That's a tough one. I don't do that bottle thing, all right? That's a parody thing I did. I don't, I don't keep empty Gatorade bottles with me. <laughs> Anyways, hey. I got an idea. How about we get this show on the road? miles so at 250 uh, stopped here in where am I Clarksville Arkansas All right. uh, man Arkansas is beautiful I love driving through here um there's a steak and shake at this little truck stop now steak and shake doesn't exist in the west it's a midwestern eastern type of thing so for the sake of variety, I'm going to go ahead and have some. I had it like once or twice before. I don't really remember what it was like. So I'm going to go ahead and try it again. Ooh, excuse me. But I'm going to be real quick. I'm going to be fast. And I'm going to get right back on the road. They closed on Sunday. I don't know, man. I don't know if I believe that guy. Well, yeah, the lights were off, but there was a there was a steak and shake manager or something. He was there and he said they're closed. That's weird. Well, I got some beef jerky instead. Extra tender. Ah, <sighs> well, man, this this place doesn't even have coffee. What kind of a truck stop doesn't have coffee? They don't even have coffee machines. Kind of weird. Anyway, I gotta get back out there.
Okay, well, I stopped in South Memphis, I think we're at. Or, sorry, I stopped in West Memphis. Um, I'm about 35 minutes away from the cross dock that I need to go to. They can't accept me today because the guy that comes out on Sunday couldn't come out. His car broke down or something. So they're going to accept me first thing in the morning, 6 a.m., I believe. And But they're going to let me stay on their property, so I'm already going to be there in the morning. So that's I got some food. I'm going to pull up to the place, and I'm going to shut down for the night. I'm actually going to back into a dock, so I'm already going to be in the dock. I'm going to shut down for the night, and I'm going to arrive just before 8. So I'm going to get more than 10 hours. Uh... So I can start as soon as six hit hits and they start unloading me, I can basically go on duty. Um, yeah, awesome. Okay, so I'm going to do that right now and I'll be there in about uh, 36 minutes, the map says. gonna chill here for a bit then um, probably do some video editing some things like that and uh, I forgot to buy more snacks since tomorrow I'll be starting my day off here but I won't be well I still have the beef jerky and I got some chips so whatever it's cool um, I'll be starting tomorrow at six, they'll load me. They're unload me real quick. It won't take more than I don't know, 15 minutes. And then I'm gonna go about 85, 90 miles east to Jackson, Tennessee. And then I'm gonna deliver my first load, and then I'm gonna come back here, pick this up, and deliver it to North Carolina. But for now, I guess I'm just gonna chill here for a bit. All right, I got bad news. I took the SD card out of this thing and it fell down here somewhere. And I hope that it didn't fall into, oh, I see it. Ha ha, there it is. Oh man, I thought this crevice was like the end of the earth. I thought it was lost forever. Now I just gotta reach it. Can't reach it. Oh, yeah. Oh, my goodness. Oh, I was so upset when that happened. I thought it was gone. Ah, oh, man, I did not come here prepared. <laughs> I should have brought some more snacks. No, I have a little bit, a little bit of Frito chips left. I had it in my mind to buy some snacks, but then I forgot. 
Oh yeah, I spent some time just now in here in my sleeper berth. Um, editing and replying to the comments and all that. Uh, re regarding the comments, it takes me quite a while to respond because, uh, you know, I drive all day and all that. So, if you guys don't get a response, don't get all discouraged. Um, I'll just get to it a little bit later. Like right now, moments like these where I have a little bit of time, I just sit down and go to town on all the comments. Um, but now it's a little bit late, so I'm going to go to bed because I want to be able to wake up before 6 tomorrow. Thank you guys for tuning in. Thank you for following along with me on this journey of mine through life and through this country. Thank you guys a whole bunch. Um, appreciate all of that. But right now, I'm passing out. So, I'm gonna uh, pass out. That's exactly what I'm gonna do. Again, thanks for tuning in, and uh, I will be seeing all of you tomorrow. Good night. Take me to a